Uh, I'm four and a half, and my name is Avery. What kind of beetle does a uh, cam uses can uh, fudge? My name is PJ Leash. I'm the director of the UW Madison Insect Diagnostic Lab. So when you think about beetles to begin with, beetles are an extremely diverse group of animals and insects on the planet. If we made a list of all the insects we know of, we have about a million or more described species, and of those, about 400,000 of them are beetles. So it's an extremely diverse group of creatures. With that said, there's certainly going to be some beetles that use camouflage. There are also other examples where beetles are very easy to spot, like lady beetles, which we can see on, on plants and on the side of buildings at certain times of the year. But an awful lot of them do use camouflage. Now, when it comes to camouflage, um, there are plenty of beetle species that blend in because they have brown or black coloration. If you go to sandy areas, there are certain tiger beetles that have beige colors on their body and can blend in very well. So there's a lot of species that have these kind of modeled color patterns to blend in with natural features on the world. There are also other examples where beetles perhaps specifically mimic something. So there are longhorn beetles that blend in very well on the bark or on branches of trees. There are also certain leaf beetles that mimic uh, droppings of insects or other animals on leaves so that they blend in. There are also insects that mimic other insects. So we have longhorn beetles that have black and yellow, very vibrant, flashy patterns on their bodies so that they mimic things like paper wasps and yellow jackets and give that false appearance of being something dangerous when they're really harmless creatures, but because they're mimicking or camouflaging themselves like something different, they get left alone. There are beetles that will camouflage themselves to look and actually smell like ants using some chemical camouflage as well. So there's really an awful lot of different beetles out there that use camouflage. So beetles can use camouflage for a number of different reasons. First is simply avoiding predators. Um, that's probably the biggest reason that they're using it. If you're hard to find, it's harder for something to come and eat you. Um, for some of them, they may be using it for other defensive purposes. Um, again, mimicking things such as wasps so that they're broadcasting that potential danger. Uh, but again, it boils back down to keeping potential predators at bay.